who is the funniest comedian of all time? W.C. Fields, to me, was my favorite. Why is a coach to you like a long journey? I don't know, Oliver. Why is a cat's tail like a long journey? Because it's spur to the end. Because it's... <laughs> He was, he was amazing. I, when I was in college, I actually, I organized W.C. Fields evenings. I turned people on to W.C. Fields, one of the funniest men that ever lived. Oh, I could see that you were the very soul of kindness. Oh, I'm very kind. But of course, I can be cruel if needs be. Um, what was the last text that you sent? I sent it to my friend Maureen to see if she wanted to get together this weekend. <laughs> uh, what what was the best decade? The best decade? Wow, that's such an interesting question. You know, so many people tell me that they would have loved to be around in the 60s. But you know what? It's good to think that whatever decade you're in is the best time. Dr. Fauci or Dr. Strange? Strange love or strange? Strange you can say the guy who wrote on the bomb, right? <laughs> Not yeah. Dr. Fauci. Fauci misled too many people. He's a bad dude. And uh, a lot is going to come out about him, I think. There's the preponderance of evidence now points towards this coming from the lab. And what you've done is change the definition right. on your website to try to cover your ass, basically. What is the best movie ever? Oh, you know what I like? The Princess Bride. For some reason, that really stuck with me. That was a very sweet movie. I really liked The Princess Bride. Hey! Hello in there! Hey! What's so important? What you got here, that's worth living for. Um, what is the biggest misconception that people have about you? <laughs> there are so many. People can't believe that I ever had children, that I ever had a pet. I don't know, I must give up a very unusual vibe. People are shocked to know that I was married and have kids and I have a family. That's the, that's the, uh, when I tell people they're shocked, like, really, you have that? I'm like, yeah, because I must come across as so unique and different that people don't think that I have what other people have or that I would even want that. So I think that that's, the misconception is that I'm not like a regular person. Really, I, I asked this little kid to describe me. He looked at me for a minute. He's like, if Phil Spector fucked Elton John. What quote do you live by? You can't change your past. The only thing you could change is your perspective of your past. That's one of the quotes from my book. I wrote that and it seems to resonate with a lot of people because a lot of people go through life regretting things in their past. And the only thing you could change, it's a big waste of time. The only thing you could change is your perspective, how you look at it. Every single thing that you ever did, you never made a mistake in your life. It's all part of your path that led to where you are right now at this moment. Everything in your life and my life led to this right now. This is our only reality, Don. We're sitting and we're talking to each other. Yesterday is gone. Who knows what's going to happen later? This is it. This is our reality right now. So uh, that's my favorite quote. Mm -hmm.